Just at six, some Austin homes under construction now at a standstill. One contractor says that's the impact of undocumented immigrants afraid to go to work. This comes as ICE steps up arrests of undocumented people with criminal histories. We also know others are taken into custody with no criminal background. KXAN's Brittany Glass explains how their fear could already be impacting our local economy. Pedro Apolinar has worked as a contractor in Austin for nearly 20 years. He says he's never seen anything like this before. I haven't seen much movement or noises since workers haven't shown up to work for fear of immigration showing up. Apolinar says since Friday, some construction sites have become ghost towns. This morning, another contractor called me up to tell me no one showed up to work for fear of immigration. So work has stopped on these homes. It's going to have a great impact on us employees and big corporations because the economy is going to go south pretty fast. If we don't have workers here, the company will not be successful, and I fear that this government is not doing it right. Republican Senator Don Buckingham says it's misinformation that's causing this fear. Those folks are probably responding to some of that misinformation. The, the truth is ICE goes off of leads and doesn't do random sweeps. Mexican consulate Carlos Gutierrez them. believes those with no criminal history have cause for concern. When immigration authorities uh, detain that person and realize that uh, the two or three colleagues that are with him, with them, um, are uh, also undocumented, they detain them all and initia in they initiate um, deportation proceedings regardless whether all of them were they were looking for them or not. Apolinar says that's why the concern is real. We have no clue what we're going to have to do, frankly. Brittany Glass, KXAN News. There are an estimated 1.1 million undocumented immigrant workers in Texas. They make up about 8.5% of the state's total labor force, many of them in construction. The Pew Research Center says about 25% of construction workers in Texas do not have documents. The Workers' Defense Project and UT say that number is closer to 50%. According to the Mexican consulate in Austin, since Thursday, Immigration and Customs Enforcement had made 54 arrests. Most of those were made on Thursday and Friday, 44 then. Five arrests were made Saturday, four on Sunday, and one today.